Hey, what's good everybody? I got another new one here for you today. This is Crypto on Fire and we're going to jump right into it so we don't waste any time. This one is bfarm.co. What they are is a cross-chain and auto yield farming. This is basically like the one we ran across a little while back being B Shield, I think it is. Let me double check. No, I think it's BUSD Shield. Yeah, it's no longer available. But there was a similar version to this. And my reason for trying to bring that up is, is because off of this, they have a eight day lockup period. That one had a seven day and a 14 day and a 30 day. Basically, the issue with these is, is that you can get in early and this is just starting today. You're gonna make 40% off of anything that you put in. So your initial investment, if you, I put a hundred dollars in here, at the end of the eight day period, I'll have $140 altogether because whatever I put in stays locked up and I can't withdraw. I can only withdraw the percentage that I gained from it. So $100 is gonna turn into $140 at the end of eight days. It's gonna turn into $188 and it's gonna turn into basically $240. but I would never put it in for 25 days or 16 days. This is only for you guys that want to risk this and put it in for the eight days to make 40% off of it, whatever amount you get and make sure you're on it like that because the last one, it jammed up because of the fact that it had so many people get into it at once that the first seven day to eight day percentage payout was too great for the company to maintain because in order for the people to cash out you need new investors to come in and with the slow you know backing behind the initial like jump from the beginning you constantly have to advertise it like ongoing like because it got too many people the first few days and it couldn't pay those people back on the first payout because after that it was just like a gradual investment for people getting in it so it, it had to sustain but this has both BUSD and BNB in it you know you can invest either one if you go down to their contract you know BNB contract code everything looks close to what it says on the website you know, there's a nice amount in there, 192 BNB, it's overall value. Same thing with the BUSD contract. It says 7,000. You go back over here to BUSD. It says 9,000. So it's pretty close. I'm not sure what the 2,000 difference is. Maybe it takes time to log in, but, um, yeah, and you can, you know, different places that you can buy BNB. And this one is definitely high, high risk. If you get in this, I would only go for the eight day lockup period. Only put in what you can afford to lose. This is not financial advice. And this is just another new one from me to you. It's B Farm. Do your own diligence. And check this one out. Peace.